dear students continuing with our lecture series on multiple choice questions this is our uh, fifth lecture in the series uh, of solving multiple choice uh, problems uh, in this uh, lecture we will see how uh, under very simple reaction conditions uh, we can get different types of uh, products through organic functional group transformations so in this lecture uh, first problem is that how uh, the substituted cyano oxypentane ester pentene ester uh, on reaction with uh, phosphorus trichloride in presence of uh, dimethyl formamide using toluene as solvent can be converted into uh, heterocyclic products and uh, uh, out of these four uh, one product can be formed through uh, uh, cyclization reactions under these conditions and we can synthesize heterocyclic compounds second problem is uh, that how substituted one four two uh, dihydro dioxazines uh, so this is uh, dihydro 56 dihydro 3 substituted 1 4 2 dioxazines they under acd conditions uh, in presence of water or we can say aqueous uh, acd conditions in presence of methanol they can give us uh, different types of products and out of these four choices which product will be formed we will uh, see in the coming uh, slides then similarly uh, these types of uh, substituted uh, benzyl amino acetonitriles uh, in uh, SD conditions uh, at low temperature in presence of chloroform uh, as a major product uh, gave us different types of products and out of those products uh, the major product uh, uh, formed is any one of uh, these four so we will see that how uh, that major product is formed uh, during the transformation of this substrate into the product then fourth problem is uh, when these types of substituted naphthalene 1,4 dione's they react with uh, pyridinium uh, salts uh, like uh, this one pyridinium uh, bromide substituted pyridinium bromide under basic condition in presence of uh, triethylamine uh, in acetonitrile as solvent uh, undergoes uh, condensation and uh, further reaction and any of these four products uh, they can be formed and we will see that out of these four choices which product is formed and what is the mechanism of formation of that product and you can see that the product formed here uh, is formed in 97% uh, here then uh, fifth and last problem is uh, how the benzthiazole uh, reacts with DMAD that is dimethyl acetylene dicarboxylate under uh, aqueous uh, methanolic conditions. So this is a very interesting reaction where uh, these uh, two they can uh, undergo uh, addition reactions to give us uh, different types of product and out of these four uh, one product will be formed and how that product is formed we will see the mechanism of the reaction. So, uh, as far as answers to these problems is concerned, uh, in the first uh, problem, the answer is C. In the second problem, answer is D. In the third, answer is B. In the fourth, answer is D. And in the fifth, answer is A. And now in subsequent slides, we will see that uh, how these products are formed and uh, what is the mechanism of formation of these products out of the four choices so in the first problem as i have told you answer is c 
So in the first step, what happens is uh, dimethyl formamide reacts with phosphorus trichloride to give us uh, Wilsmeyer Hack reagent. And you know this Wilsmeyer Hack reagent this can react with uh, aldehydic functional group. So uh, in this substrate uh, that is uh, oxopentenone uh, pentenoate that is oxopentene ester. Uh, this because of the pre uh, presence of this methylene group uh, this hydrogen is very acidic and this can undergo enolization to give us uh, this type of enolic structure and because of the presence of two lone pair of lactones on the, this oxygen this will interact with this uh, wills married hack reagent which has been formed in the first step and uh, we will get this type of oxonium ion uh, as an intermediate which will lose a proton from here to neutralize the charge positive charge on oxygen which is uh, not a very stable uh, intermediate because uh, oxygen being an electro uh, negative element uh, it uh, is not stable when positive charge is present on oxygen so this will lose proton and we will have uh, this type of neutral intermediate which is formed then uh, this neutral intermediate will undergo elimination of this halogen as uh, chloride uh, negative which will uh, attack on the carbon of this uh, nitrile and uh, because of this uh, this nitrogen uh, will attack this carbon and a cyclization reaction will take place uh, in the first step uh, we will have this type of enolate formed and then this enolate will uh, undergo reorganization of the pi electrons and uh, uh, positive charge on this oxygen will be neutralized with the elimination of uh, dimethyl formamide from here and we will get uh, this C as the product that is ethyl 2 chloro uh, nicotinate uh, is formed as the product. So this is how uh, these oxopentene pent uh, uh, 2 eno enoate that is uh, oxopentene ester is converted into uh, nicotinic ester that is nicotinate is formed from this simple reaction where uh, DMF and phosphorus uh, trichloride they generate the Wilsmeyer Hack reagent which uh, catalyzes the conversion of uh, this uh, LDHD group followed by cyclization to give us the product. Then uh, in the second problem answer is uh, D uh, that is uh, when 5,6-dihydro uh, uh, this is 5,6-dihydro 3 substituted 1,4-dioxide uh, 2 uh, AZ. So when these substrates uh, they are uh, reacted under acidic conditions, this uh, will take up the pro this nitrogen will take up the proton and will have a positive charge. And because of this, this pair of electrons, uh, pi electrons, they are attracted towards nitrogen and this carbon becomes electrophilic. And water acts as a nucleophile and attacks this carbon to have. Uh, then we can have this type of uh, intermediate which can lose proton and this H is shifted from here to this nitrogen to acquire the positive charge because positive charge on oxygen is not stable. So because of that this proton gets shifted to this nitrogen uh, which uh, is more stable in comparison to oxygen to acquire the positive charge and then uh, because of the lone pair of lactone present on this uh, hydroxyl group uh, this carbon nitrogen bond breaks and we will get this type of intermediate and here again uh, this undergoes uh, uh, H positive shift and uh, this oxygen will acquire the uh, positive charge now and then uh, water will act as a nucleophile because this carbon will become electrophilic uh, because of the presence of positive charge on this oxygen and with the loss of, uh, loss of this 
hydroxylamine we will get uh, these types of product which is our choice uh, d out of the four choices so we will get uh, aryl alkyl acids as the product uh, through hydrolysis of uh, this heterocyclic ring uh, under acidic conditions in presence of Then third problem is uh, these types of uh, substituted uh, benzyl amino nitriles under acidic conditions. Uh, this uh, carbon uh, nitrogen triple bond uh, will take up this proton and this nitrogen will require the positive charge. And then because of the presence of lone pair of electrons on this uh, substituent methoxy group, uh, there will be a cyclization uh, between this carbon and this carbon and we will have a five membered uh, heterocyclic ring form uh, due to the movement of uh, electron pair from uh, this oxygen to uh, this carbon to form a carbon carbon bond at this place. Then uh, this lone pair of uh, electron present on nitrogen, uh, this is shifted to this place to create a carbon nitrogen double bond and this carbon carbon bond breaks and we can have this type of intermediate where uh, positive charge is present on nitrogen. And then uh, because of the presence of this methoxy group, this will undergo uh, movement of electron pair from here to here and a carbon carbon bond uh, is created at this place so this five membered heterocyclic ring is converted into six membered heterocyclic ring in this way and this type of intermediate is formed and uh, hso4 negative will remove uh, this uh, proton from here uh, and aromatization of this ring will take place and this, then this uh, carbon nitrogen double bond will undergo uh, hydrolysis uh, with the elimination of ammonia molecule from here and we will get these types of uh, dihydropyridinones uh, as the uh, products. So this is uh, choice B uh, in our uh, problem number 3 and this is formed as the region. Then fourth problem is uh, uh, when uh, pyridinium uh, salts, uh, for example, substituted pyridinium bromide, uh, this reacts with the under basic conditions. So triethylamine uh, interacts with this uh, pyridinium bromide with the elimination of proton from here and bromide and from here. Triethylammonium bromide is removed and we will get this type of carbonine generated in the pyridinium. Uh, bromide salt and then this carbonine will interact with the naphthalene 1,4-dione uh, uh, and 1,4 uh, addition will take place, 1,4 uh, uh, addition of this uh, carbonine will take place. So uh, this is 1, 2, 3 and 4. So uh, carbonine will attack at this position and enolate will be generated. And then this enolate uh, will abstract this proton uh, and uh, aromatization of this uh, will be completed with the formation of uh, this enolate. So uh, basically this type of enolate uh, is converted into more stable uh, enolate and then this enolate will uh, again undergo uh, reorientation uh, of this uh, electrons with the elimination of uh, pyridine moiety from here and we will get this alpha beta unsaturated so uh, formed at this place and then this uh, will undergo one five sigma tropic uh, rearrangement and the shifting of uh, hydrogen will take place in the presence of triethylamine and we will get this type of uh, neutral intermediate which will undergo uh, elimination of triethylammonium uh, ether uh, phenyl ether uh, from the uh, from this moiety and we will have uh, this type of uh, alkene uh, which is uh, in z configuration and this uh, alkene uh, will undergo isomerization to uh, get converted into 
e uh, conformation and this e conformation will undergo 3 3 sigma tropic rearrangement uh, to cyclize to give us these types of uh, e ethers uh, as the product and this you can see is our choice d out of the four the choices which have been given for this drop and last problem is uh, when benzthiazoles uh, they react with uh, dimethylsplin dicarboxylate uh, because of the presence of this lone pair of lactones on this nitrogen uh, this will add to this unsaturated carbon-carbon triple bond and we will have this type of uh, carbonine uh, formed. So dianine is formed, carbon is having negative charge, nitrogen is having positive charge. And uh, because of the presence of positive charge on this nitrogen, this carbon will become lactophilic and uh, water as an ethylophile will uh, add to the carbon-nitrogen double bond to uh, give us this type of intermediate uh, then uh, this from here uh, transfer of uh, proton will take place from here to <clears throat> this carbonine and we will have uh, dihydrobenzthiazole derivative where uh, neutralization of the charges will take place then this will undergo <clears throat> uh, proton shift uh, with the breaking of this uh, carbon sulfur bond and uh, then this intermediate will undergo rotation and then cyclization because uh, thiols uh, they can very easily add to the carbon carbon double so uh, they uh, will undergo uh, addition to the carbon carbon double bond leading to cyclization uh, with the formation of a uh, six membered ring like this and then uh, hydrogen shift from here uh, from this sulfur to this carbon will lead to the formation of product A out of the four choices which we have seen. Thank you very much.